Hey guys, it's Stacey and today I'm here to do a book review on The Liar's Room by Simon Lelick. And if you hear anything, there is a Betty in my lap who is very talkative today. But I'm here to do a review on this. I received this book in a giveaway and I really enjoyed it so I thought I'd do a book review on it. But this book doesn't come out until the 15th of this month. But this is a th an adult thriller following Susanna who has a secret. 14 years ago, she up and left her life and identity and has reinvented herself as a therapist. But then a man named Adam comes into her office um, claiming he needs help, but asking certain qu Susanna certain questions that makes her, thinks, makes her think he knows who she is. Um, and the story takes place primarily in that one day in her office um there are some flashbacks from uh Susanna's past life or whatever and Betty but there are flashbacks um and Adam keeps asking unsettling questions and Susanna is very afraid of what he might know and this was a very intense thriller trigger warning for there is rape mentions of rape animal cruelty animal death all sorts of things this was a very intense very edge of your seat type thriller um the first like 50 pages i wasn't sure if i was gonna like it or not because there just wasn't i felt like the story wasn't progressing in those pages when i read a thriller i want it to be action-packed from the beginning but this is kind of a lengthy thriller but it was very interesting um and it was just very intense um you learn about Susanna's past and what she's running from and you learn why Adam is there and the twist of why Adam was there and how he knew all this was very I didn't see it coming very unique twist I've never seen before um I have been getting into thrillers recently I do enjoy them um this was very, very different from any thriller I've ever read. It was kind of like, I don't know if this is classified as a domestic thriller, but it was interesting nonetheless. And I really enjoyed it. I did give it four out of five stars. It wasn't like a full blown five out of five star thriller for me. It takes a lot for a thriller to be five stars for me. Um, but this was, this was unique and interesting. I hope more people read it. Um, this is an art copy, so I don't know if anything is going to really change in the time that the arc is different from the uh, finished version, but I'm very glad I got to read this early. I really like Susanna as a character. I thought she, um, she was very interesting and she had a lot of layers and you didn't really expect the reason why she uh, left her, her old identity and created a new one. You didn't really expect that to be the reason why that was in this book um which i thought was great there are also trigger warnings for uh mentions of suicide and stuff um and arson there, there's several trigger warnings in this i put uh, most of the trigger warnings in my goodreads review that i did for this as well which i will link my goodreads down below in case you want to read that um but yeah, I really enjoyed this and I hope more people read it and um, whatever this author comes out with next, I hope it's another thriller because I will most likely read it. But that is it for this video. Sorry for Betty being Betty. Um, she's in a mood today. But that is it for this video and I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in another one. Bye!